good morning out in the woods today doing some gear testing and today I've got for you the one tigress feather light quilt this is a synthetic product and it's actually pretty lightweight for what you get and uh, we're gonna get into it next okay so this has a couple of names I don't know if it's like a one tigress top quilt or one tigress black orca feather light quilt or something like that let me show you the side here So, looks like it's rated from 5 to 20 degrees Celsius. It's polyester, used to hammock. <laughs> I think it's meant to say used for, used in a hammock, whatever. And as we've come to expect from One Tigress, very nice stuff sack. And uh, again, you know, I could, uh, I could really get the size of this down by using the stuff sack and compressing that down. So uh, you can get more out of it and uh, fit more in your pack. So again, this is not a, this is more of a three season quilt, but it's supposed to be a decent size. So I'm wondering if it can be combined with some other products that will uh, turn it into a, uh, to a winter sleeping bag. Let's tear into it now. Okay, so I've taken the quilt out of the, out of its pack. Yeah, it's pretty light. I have had a look at the stitching and it, it so far seems pretty good. We'll see how it holds up over time, but so far most of their products have been decent. I haven't had any problems. This is a top quilt, which is not a sleeping bag. A sleeping bag wraps right around you. A top quilt is the same, except that it sort of emits the back. And the reason for that is you're going to save a little bit of weight because first of all, when you're sleeping on that sleeping bag and you've pressed that insulation layer down so thin it does very little to keep you warm and especially in a hammock here where you've got this hanging under quilt you've got that to keep your back warm so this has a little bit of a slit here no zippers and it's got this little foot box here so your feet go in there stay toasty warm and this generally stays open but one tigress has included a few tabs looks like decent quality velcro so you can open this up or you can close it up and there's three there so you can get this pretty tight almost like a sleeping bag if you wanted to generally i'm comfortable sleeping without these okay this um, is 74.99 on one tigress's website it does have ripstop nylon it's actually pretty lightweight even for a five degree bag it's 35 ounces that's pretty reasonable for for a polyester filled bag if it can indeed keep that temperature so we're definitely below that today we're negative one, negative two here now. I'm gonna get in and try this out. So I've got my foot box here. And I just find it easier to do this before you get in. It's just kind of hard to shuffle around whilst you're in there. Swing on over and in you go. Okay, let's check my under quilt. Yep. All right, so the back is wide open and I've got my undercoat underneath me. Today is negative one. This bag's rating is plus five. So obviously we're surpassing it. So this will be a good test. I just want to lay here for a little bit and see. See, I definitely feel warmth already, which is a good sign bag is super smooth nice material gray on the inside and a nice OD green like most of most of their stuff so let me lay have a little nap and I'll tell you about it after I just had a little 10 minute nap in here and uh, everything's nice and toasty. Um, actually a little bit too warm. I had to take off my hat. So I'm not saying that this is good for freezing temperatures, but I'm a warm sleeper. I've got a few layers on and I've been kind of running around here. Yeah, I think it's uh, 
it's probably good for me probably down to a little bit less than the five degree mark but i'm not sure about everyone else it's really comfortable really soft there's lots of room in here so i could probably fit a small little blanket underneath or something else if i want to increase the rating foot box is nice keeping my feet nice and warm and uh yeah i'm so far i'm quite enjoying it okay so let me give you some of my final thoughts here I spent only about 10 minutes in this bag, so obviously it's kind of hard to give you a full review on it, but I can tell that uh, immediately, as soon as I put this on, I felt heat radiating back, and that's a good thing. Today is definitely well below, six degrees Celsius below the rating of this bag, which is rated at uh, five, minimum of five degrees Celsius. I was toasty. Now, I've been kind of running around here all day, um, not so much the last little while, but I do have a couple of layers on, just some thin layers and a thin flannel shirt here. And I was absolutely toasty to the point where I actually took off my hat because I began sweating in just a few minutes. And uh, then I sort of pulled the bag down a little bit, just adjusted it. And then, you know what, it felt pretty good. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure that in this temperature here that I'd be able to camp with this guy here. This is listed for $74.99 on the One Tigers website. And I think that's a pretty reasonable deal. It weighs 35 ounces. That's less than two pounds. You get a pretty good quality sleeping unit. You no, know, like I said, it's not down. It's not downfilled. I do have a downfilled quilt which is actually looks almost the same as this but it, it's you know almost three times the price and uh it the the benefits are that it basically it weighs 19 ounces as opposed to 35 and when it compacts down it's like maybe not even one and a half softballs and this is at least two two and a half of that so it can maybe even three so this is this is much larger when it compacts but the i have to give one tigers credit that uh, you know they did keep the weight fairly low for a polyester filled product and uh, you know what the seams all look good it's ripstop material OD green is the color I like it I don't like to stand out in here I like to kind of blend in as much as possible though in the snow it's kind of hard to do but yeah this is definitely coming with me on some future trips and uh, you know all these One Tigers products here you have pretty much an entire sleep system for around 200 us you've got the hammock you've got the winter under quilt and this three season top quilt but with a few minor modifications you could probably make this a uh, a four season quilt as well and uh you know what for around 200 bucks to get that that's uh that's that's a good value and uh you know what i'm, I'm pretty impressed with their products you know i look forward to seeing what else they come out with so guys i've showed you everything you need to get out and winter camp some pretty budget-minded options here so you've got no excuse get in the woods get camping and come back and see me in the next video take care